and Google's TPUs, you know, are probably going to do well, uh, especially in a rapidly growing chip environment. But uh, but they're probably not going to unseat uh, Nvidia. That would be that would be my guess. And by the way, like um, others have been doing this chip replacement thing for specialized purposes as well. So uh, a perfect example of it is Tesla changed out their chips from Nvidia chips uh, in in their third generation of their full self-driving hardware. Um, this was done roughly, I want to say, five, six years ago, where they actually uh, switched over, or five years ago, maybe, they switched over to their own AI chips uh, that um, were uh, optimized for self-driving purposes. And they needed a subset of the instruction set that NVIDIA chips had, and therefore they could make a chip that was way more optimized, way more power efficient for their purpose, used less than 100 watts versus 300 watts of power. Um, and Tesla has been using those chips in all of, all of their vehicles uh, for infer inference, which is uh, what the car uses to decide what to do. Um, and both their hardware three and hardware four, and of course the future is hardware five, is going to be using Tesla's own chip. So the the sort of like custom specific chip for specific purpose has already been something that has been going on for some time. The same thing also happened in the mining community. 